Uh, hello, uh, I'm Michael Snow, uh, and I'm, I'm an artist. Well, I was born in Toronto, uh, but then we, we moved immediately to Montreal. So I lived in Montreal for till I was uh, about uh, f five or six. In 61 I, or 62, I, I moved to New York. I li lived in New York and lived in New York about about 10 years. I went to OCA because when I graduated from high school, I was awarded the art prize, which somewhat surprised me. Uh, but on the basis of that prize, I decided I would go and study art at the Ontario College of Art. I started to, to, to do things, paintings, that didn't have anything to do with the school class. I just got interested in through the class, but also through these sort of independent things, I got I got more and more involved in in, in painting and in learning about the history history of it. There's an exhibition coming up at the Ontario at the Art Gallery of Ontario, or it was the Art Gallery of Toronto then actually, and it's an open jury and any anyone can can present propose a, a, a painting for the, the show that was going to come up in a couple of months. I did it and they were accepted and it was kind of sensational that a student was, was in a professional show. After I'd been in Europe for, for, for almost a year, I, I, I came back and had an exhibition at Hart House, which was most, most was my my first very public exhibition. It was a two-man exhibition with Graham Coftry, was the other other artist. He he'd been at OCA while I was there. And anyway, to make a long story short, I, I I got a phone call from someone who said he'd seen the exhibition and was very impressed by my work and would like to meet me. So we we met, and it turned. He 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 said, "There there are things in your in your drawings and paintings that seem to indicate that you're very interested in in film, in the in the movies." And I had to admit that unfortunately that that wasn't really true, but I found it very inter interesting. But he said, on the basis of that, I would like to offer you a job. We're learning how to do animation because I think there's there's something in your drawing that 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 would be be very uh, very at home learn, learning how to do animation. The man who hired me was the director. His name was George Dunning, and about two years after the company folded, he was the director of the Beatles film. The, the Yellow Submarine. While I was working there, George Dunning said, if you want to use the animation stand and make a film of your own, well, this was amazing. So I made my first film called A to Z, which is animated drawings. I hope all my work is, each one is quite singular. They're, 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 it's hard to compare them. Of the uh, public sculptures that I've done, uh, I think the audience, uh, which is on the building that used to be called the Sky Dome, is something I'm quite proud of. The individual sculptures, as as kind of characters, are are. F Looking in particular, each in a particular location, and, and they're each making a gesture that that relates to appraisal. Like they're, they're either for, or against, for or against you, or or they're waving it to you. So there, there's there's the, these two uh, strange gestures. This one and, and this, <laughs> which which are aimed at, at you. <laughs> I was asked by uh, the architects, uh, Piercing, 
Yes, and we to consider doing some something in what, what was the new Eaton Center that was it was it was almost completely finished uh, when this happened, and uh, Pierce indicated certain places that he thought would be it would be interesting. But what really struck me when, when, I, when I actually was in the building was the uh, amount of, of just pure kind of air space there was as an enclosure. Uh, and I thought I, I, I should do something in the air and not, not on the wall or not on the floor. The idea of birds, birds came up. And I remember a, a conversation with, with my wife at the time, Joyce Wheeland, when the, when the idea of Canada geese came up. But the, the first general idea was put something in the, in the air. And then I thought, what, what, go, what goes in the air? Birds. The, the school had a wonderful effect on me in my, in, in my life. And so I'm, I'm honored to be honored <laughs> by the school.